Are you all right? asked the boy. There is something I haven't told you, said the horse. What? I can fly. You can fly? Yes, but I stopped because it made the other horses jealous. Well, we love you whether you can fly or not. And then you can see that the horse there. Oh, it's got wings. It's got wings, yeah. So I'm going to stop there because I think it's an important point. Um, and the important point um, is for me is that the horse was clearly hiding their talents because of the fear of judgment of others or the jealousy or because he, he, had, he was just a bit different or they were just a bit different. And this is where I think, you know, where we, for me, we have to live our truth no matter what that is. You know, if we've got talent, we shouldn't be hiding it. We should be embracing it. And I think there was a lot, a lot of that goes on. People tend to dial stuff down if they're not that confident because they're actually are good at something, but they don't want to be all different from everybody else. But you know what? I think it's good to be different. I think it's um, it's your uniqueness that you bring to the planet. So I used to when I when I was younger, I didn't want to used to like I didn't want to stand out. You know, I didn't want to sort of display anything. So I think now I think you know I look back and I think that was due to my own confidence. So just embrace your strengths and just be who you are you know as long as you're doing good in the world and they're, they're, a, you're a force for good you know be the person display your talents be the person you're meant to be and don't be fearful don't and as lee said okay. before no judgment like don't listen to the judgment of others so that's what i'd say to you all right just uh just do not listen to the judgment of others you got to go your own path and do it that way but anyway lee i'm just going to um just throw that over to you Okay, and I agree on that thing. You see that, um, and I think it, it's not just talents, but like ideas and things as well. It's so mm. easy to hold on to them for fear of being judged on them, and you, you shouldn't be afraid of putting them out there. And it's, well, you know my thing last year on the no judgment thing, and actually, what you've got to do first is not worry about that judgment, and hopefully that that passes on to other people. You and I say it. this as someone who is talented at everything. I feel the pain sometimes of of that judgment as well. Yeah, the, the weight of it all, right? It's, the weight it's, of it all. It's a burden to carry. <laughs> but no, I think I, I like that because it's a metaphor for ideas as well. I think you really that's a really good point you made there because I think, you know, we have an idea, don't we? And we're yeah, a bit frightened yeah. to share it. In fact, I had an idea Especially and I shared it with you and I was actually a bit different. nervous of sharing it with you. Um, but I think it's got to get out in the world and then whatever happens, whatever happens. But it's all about that. And I think, uh, you know, sometimes it's not going to work, right? But... You know, I know I can trust people, but sometimes you've got to run with them, haven't you? Hundred percent. And like you said, especially as it's a growing up thing, you realise that yeah, you know, the younger you are, the more it's kind of fitting in to an extent. And then the older you get, you realise the differences are the thing that set you apart and make you interesting. Yeah, and it was all about fitting in for me. I definitely didn't want to stick out. I was definitely one of those children that just wanted to blend into the background. Um, so yeah. Uh -huh.